get her. Leave this at the end of the jet bridge, you'll get it back at the end of the jet bridge in Detroit, okay? Okay. To Detroit. Gotta check my bag, because the plane we're riding on is like super small. Probably one of the smaller aircrafts that's still commercial. I think it's got two seats on one side and one row of seats on the other side. That's how small it is. The whole truck is very small plane. Hi. Michigan for the day before I have to go uh, do some work tomorrow. This uh, company, Benstown, has given me the opportunity to meet these really important industry professionals that work for like huge media companies. Hear me out. They pay for a super nice hotel, and then I'm just gonna go there and like see what the company's like, and then do my thing, you know, like be my, you know, vlog self, of course. Yeah. So I'm in Detroit for the uh, next few days. Looks pretty big. It's kind of like a mall in here. You got like shops over here, shops over there. It's a lot of walking though. I mean, I've been walking for a minute. I'm still not to the baggage claim area or the terminal or nothing. So. Howdy. Pretty good, man. I'm going to the MGM Grand here in Detroit. I've never been. Have you been there? Uh, I've been. Around, I've never been to that one. Cool, cool. I'm excited. I'm gonna do the penny slots and then see. <laughs> see how much I can get out of this. Yeah, thanks, Ken. Have a good one. You too. Okay, just got in my hotel room. Look at this view. Look at this. Detroit. <laughs> All of Detroit is mine. Look at this. Nick, we hope you have so much fun with Bob and Fred. Safe travels, your Benstown fam. Oh, thank you, Benstown fam. Okay, it is very early in the morning and I have to leave in like 10, 15 minutes. I'm just getting a cup of coffee and then I'm gonna get on the road. It's like very early, like 6 a.m. Like 6 a.m. early. Look outside, the sun's not even up yet. This is the city right now. It's still dark and I'm up. We should live our lives on a high life. All right, so I'm just waiting on a lift. I was trying to give you the most time, but then nobody trying to waste no time. Okay, now I'm in this little area of Michigan called Gross Point. It's like really weird because it's it's like all of Michigan kind of looks older, but then all of a sudden you get to this and it looks colonially old. <laughs> but you can tell it's like super clean and new in here. I gotta get some stuff from CVS real quick.
I'm going or when I'm going. I'm pretty sure. It's the end of this hallway. That's not it. That's not it. That's not it. Cliche giant gray office building this looks. Super gray in here. Very corporate casual. That is an Emmy. Yes. It's his Emmy. <laughs> <laughs> and this that's an MTV Music Award, Video Music Award, and it belongs to this whole company. Isn't that cool? Let me point out one more. Uh oh. The uh, Radio Hall of Fame. Last year, Fred was inducted into. Live your life, live your life. This is going to be Nick's quick tour of the MGM Grand in Detroit. The 16th story view. Beautiful couch, just sit in front of it. You got this awesome bed. It looks a lot better when it's made up. And this cool little backlight. So that it's like a it's like a nightlight when you're sleeping. Big TV, desk area, with hardwired internet access, which is um, kind of hard to find nowadays. The coolest part about this whole place is probably the bathroom. Now it's a little bit messy, but we got our vanity here. We've got an amazing huge bathroom with floor to ceiling glass and then you go in the shower and you've got this weird like stained glass back there and a shower head and another shower head and I gotta check out in like three minutes I really don't want to I wish I could just spend the whole day in here it's kind of like a, a theme park like that's the whole hotel this is the hotel part that's the casino there's the parking garage. All right, time to go get some food and then get on the road because I've got like very little time left here. So I'm in the casino right now. I want to go to this Detroit Institute of Art, but like I need to get a ride there. So I'm pretty sure that the hotel will give me a shuttle for free. I'm just going to go figure that out now. My hotel? Yeah. What's your room number? 1604. 1604. Let me see if I can get a car service to take you. It's a complimentary from the hotel, but... Okay. Just got out of the car. It's a nice little Cadillac. It's cool. It's like a hotel uh, car. Now I'm on Cass Avenue down at Wayne State University. It's a nice chill little area, you know, college campus. Going to this uh, Greek place right up here, I think. It's raining and it's cold and it's definitely Detroit today. Oh. How's it going? Now I'm at this. Uh, Pita restaurant. We got the pita. It's delicious. Oh, somebody messed up. <laughs> uh oh, making a ticket. Parking should be free. Parking meters are a scam. You know what parking shouldn't, you shouldn't be able to park for more than like 24 hours, of course, because we don't want people just parked all over the street. It's rainy. I'm a block away from the museum, it's kind of cold, and it's definitely Detroit now. If the camera's shaking, it's because my hand is shivering. Detroit Museum, here we go. Hey, look at her. She's so pretty. the DIA. This museum is huge. I've been here for a couple hours and I haven't even had a chance to see about half of it. It's all... They have like such a huge Middle Eastern history art section in here. Like, look at all this. This is Iranian... All of this is Iranian artifacts. That's, that's Iraqi. That's not Iranian. This right here, that's Iraqi, but it's beautiful. These are all beautiful stone pieces. Look at that belt. That's a ceremonial belt that someone would wear in about 850 BCE Iran. These are coins from the Iranian Empire. These things are like BC era coins. Like everything here is old. <laughs> All 
Are you from the uh, MGM? I'm going to come and see here. <laughs> oh, they close at four. Oh, well, damn it. Yeah, they they cl they open at like nine or ten. Come back tomorrow. See you, man. Um, that wasn't my ride, but I'm gonna stand out here and wait for it just in case they do come. It's just like at the light, though. I thought it'd be fast, but there is a lot of people waiting on McDonald's. I didn't really count on that. Anyways, things are going great. I'm still tired though. I think I'm just out of energy. I need those carbohydrates. Okay, it's not that late, but I'm tired and I'm in the airport. And I'm going to my gate right now. And I'm tired. Did I mention I'm tired? <laughs> 